previews of Silence Like Glass. Darling, do you need a ride to, for your play to go dancing tonight? Yes, I do. Mm. But hold on, let me go. My stomach hurts. Did you take your medicine? No. Well, you need to take your medicine. It makes me feel funny. Here, take the medicine. Mm, you know you have cancer, and this will kill the cancer cells. And you'll be healthy again, and you can dance. This will probably be my last night on stage. Um, mother? <laughs> um, good luck. Thanks. I guess I'll just suffer in silence. I'm still going to be a dancer. The doctors called and said that you have no more cancer cells. And you're cured. Oh my god. I love you. I love you too. Thanks for being there and helping me beat this and reminding me of taking my medicine. Mom? I have no more cancer. I've heard. Oh, congratulations. I'm so glad you're going to be here with us. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, watch my new upcoming movie, Silence Like Glass. And stay tuned for previews of the new Will and Groose reboot, the behind the scenes. <laughs> oh, the best show ever is, um, The Pet Psychic. I mean, hello, the best show ever. Oh, what's that? Uh, a dog telling the future or something? <laughs> no, Karen. <laughs> what are you, born underneath a rock? <laughs> <laughs> Cut. <laughs> oh, well. Y'all are both Will and Grace. That's cool. And who is he supposed to be? Well, they can't just... Are you going to be Jack? No. I'm going to play Linda's girlfriend. I mean, I'm going to play Linda's boyfriend. <laughs> yeah, honey. You could be a better off playing it. Her girlfriend. <laughs> no. So, do you want to go on a date tonight? I mean, I'm a really good actor. I could be anything. I'm not going to go out with you just because you're so full of yourself and you, like, you're into yourself so much just because you like yourself. I'm not going to go out with you just because you're that into yourself. <laughs> <sighs> the new Will and Grace. The behind the scenes making of the Will and Grace. And this is where we find all the talented teens. Everyone who wants to join a modeling agency or a join in to be in a movie is all here. I'll be the touch. So come up and you won't be excluded. You there might be a part for you to play. But every one of you, I assure you. Is gonna have a career in this Omega Beta Zeta home. Mm -hmm. That's me reporting live, Susan Sydney mm -hmm. and Adrian, my husband. Here, take on the lead of explaining to them an MTV's next uh, top star. <laughs> okay. Uh, come into a journey where you can find a uh, career for you. <laughs> Just pick. <laughs> Behind the scenes. Oh, God. Hello. Lila. Lily. You're going to be having to move out. I mean, I, I need my space. Like... I, I got too much work rooms. You just can't be here. <laughs> so, what? <sighs> there is a loft I can t uh, make you go move to, and it it'll be okay. So, but what about my other sister? She's going to school here for art. <laughs> so, 
so I can't just kick her out. I mean, I'm, I'm buying you your own place, okay? <laughs> Whatever, I could just live in the loft next to her or up in the attic. <laughs> oh, we'll think about it. Uh, why don't you just kill me? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mom, where are you? I'm just home from school. I wanted to ask you a question. What, dear? <laughs> I'm home from school, and I was just ask wanted to ask you a question. What is it? Um. Uh, there's this, uh, my friend Ivy, she's downstairs. I was wondering if she could uh, stay with us a couple of days, maybe a week. Um, I was just telling your sister that she had to leave. I, there's not enough space here. The only reason why you're going to be able to here because you're in the artist loft. I need my business. I need more space for my business. Do you understand? Okay, whatever, Mom. I'm... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wait. Um, what? <sighs> they kicked me out. What? They kicked me out. You're like a spool of rat. You get to live there. Well, is that why you're here at the art center? Yeah. You don't get it. I, I just don't know anymore. But I might as well be. I'm living on my own. I'm independent. I don't care. I mean, you could say she kicked me out. Or you could just say she moved me out. I don't know. But I guess I'm going to have to live with it either way. Hey. <laughs> uh, I heard what she said. Don't worry. She just cares about you. Um, I'll just leave and, you know, stay the night with, you know, my dad, who just has this porn addiction, I don't, and there's not enough room in the hotel to, um, keep me from hearing that. Oh, Ivy. Wait. Ivy? Yeah, you can stay. It's okay. You girls have fun. Y'all go ahead and you can stay in the artist's law for the garden or just, you know, here, whatever, as long as you like, okay? Sounds alrighty. Oh, thanks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Come on, let's go, Ivy. My mom's being weird. Mm, at least she lets lets me stay and have a good time. So we can have a good time. You know, I don't have very many friends. Well, any friends. But I'm glad that you're going to stay. Me too. I'm, everybody hates me. <laughs> there she was, my best friend. Come on, Coop, Cooper. I never had any, buddy, never met anyone so, um, alluring and, like, kind of out there as you. Thanks, yeah. Uh. 
I I just guess I'm gonna start a vlog and yeah. Um this is my hair. Um I shaved it into an eye. <laughs> and like when my dad found out that I shaved it into an eye, I said it was just this female balding <laughs> problem, you know. And he got mad at me that but Whatever. <laughs> that's, that's funny. It's cool. It's very beautiful. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? <laughs> oh. Uh, are you recording? Oh, yeah, this is my vlog that I was going to be, you know, doing. <laughs> I mean, in case anybody on the geek internet wants to date me, I mean, I, I'm really not looking for a date, but, you know, to make me freak out. But, um, yeah, I'm, you know, at the artist loft <laughs> with a, the famous mother and all, <laughs> but no one really notices me <laughs> as me, but yeah, um, well, I've noticed you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> you are beautiful. Oh, stop. And a great um, painter or writer. Mm -hmm. No, I just, I'm an artist. Yeah, I can write and, you know, I misspell a few words here and there, but I, I mean, I'm a pretty good writer. <laughs> and how did you know I wrote? I read your diary. <laughs> You're, you're, what? You're, wait, you're very poetic. I mean, if anybody, you know, if you ever died and stuff, um, you know, you'd had something left behind that would be really, it was really cool. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> I think that, um, we'll be doing some things you'll have to write about a lot more interesting but no, Coop, it's okay. What do you mean? Interesting. I mean, uh, life, my life's kind of boring. Oh, well, we can change that. <laughs> Your life's not boring. I'm boring. No, you're not. Maybe I should dye my hair blonde like Cindy Lauper. <laughs> No, it wouldn't suit you. You look more, you wouldn't be yourself. <laughs> you might look like a cheap a hooker or something. <laughs> hey, what's up with that? Oh, is it hurt? No, my nose piercing? No, it just makes me feel like there's a big bugger. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> okay. Where, um, Cube, where are you going? Darlene, where are you going? <laughs> um, I mean, if you want to leave and move somebody else, that's fine, but where are you going? <laughs> oh, me and Ivy are gonna, um, shouldn't you be in school? Yeah, that's it. We're going to school. Mm -hmm. Dress like that. Mm -hmm. You know something? Ivy, wait. What? <laughs> You're dressing kind of provocative. I mean, I am someone who is with the model and studio and stuff. And, you know... Less is more. Do you want to try some clothes on in my, um, closet? Oh, hell yes. I mean, yes, that'd be wonderful. Okay, come on. Here's my closet. Oh, what? Wait, what's that? Ooh, the clothes. Uh, cool. Oh, that 
that's a um, Batman's uniform. You know, there's a series and all we're working on. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, what a beautiful outfit. Yeah, hold on. Let me show you what I, I used to dress like when I was your age. Okay, I haven't tried this one in years. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, back. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Surprise. Oh, wow. That looks cute. Yeah. It's really um supermodel looking like mm hmm thanks <laughs> yeah well I'm thinking well mm, you know can I wear that <laughs> for the part for the party ball that you know you're too busy to go to <laughs> what party ball <laughs> I'm ahead of all of them mainly well not really um, well, just the next one that maybe comes up. <laughs> mm, this is vintage. Um, I don't know, maybe, um, you know, it's, in, it's insured, come on. It, you would look, you okay. <laughs> uh, right? No. Maybe, maybe I'll, I was really actually letting, um, I'm going to think about giving it to Cooper. So Darlene, you know, I think she would, she would never wear it, but, um, I would, well, maybe I can get her to wear it. <laughs> let me borrow it. Come on, let me borrow it. No. And I just don't trust in anybody else's hands. Come on, let me bar it. <laughs> it's okay. I, I mean, it's really pretty. I mean, she would look, Coop would look really good in it. I'll convince her. Come on, just let me wear it. I mean, I mean take it to her. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um, well, I'm going to change back. <laughs> and I said no. Hands off. Sorry. <laughs> Here's a dress that I'll let you borrow. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Gotta go. Ring, ring, ring. The phone's ringing. Mm -hmm. And did my mom show you the dresses that she wants me to wear? Yeah. They're totally hideous. Don't tell your mom. They're pretty vintage and hideous looking. They're not my style. <laughs> Oh, yeah, sorry. I wouldn't get caught dead in them either. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Well, wait. I, I kind of want to make your mom happy. She seems kind of sad. <sighs> With her life. What do you mean? She's the big celebrity. She's not sad. <laughs> Hmm, maybe I'll wear this some other time then. Okay, let's go, come on. You make me sick. Do I make you sick? Do I make you sick? What is the matter? Calm down. Do I make you sick? Hmm. No, you don't. Just calm down. 
Have you been drinking again? Drinking. Ugh. Yeah, right. You know, I stopped that years ago. Wait. What am I waiting for? <laughs> you to take me to the ball or whatever? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Just get away from me. <laughs> My mother. What do you want? You're a lousy person. What do you mean? I, I didn't do anything. You're a slob. You shouldn't be dressing like that around your friend. Does she like people like you? Liars. I'm not lying about anything. You, you lie all the time. Come on, darling. <laughs> Don't call me that. I hate that name. Well, it's your name. I gave it to you. <laughs> just come on. What are you gonna do? Kill me? Just just kill me now and get it over with. I'm freaking done. What are you talking about, Mom? You're scaring me. You're freaking me out. Quit talking like that. Just do it, darling. You know you want to kill me. You hate me. No, I don't. Just... <laughs> oh. What are you going to do? You and your sisters need to get together and tell me what you're going to do. What do you mean do? Um, you know, Haley's going to probably go to school and be a scientist or a massage therapist. I don't know. I'm, I'm going to art. Art. <laughs> you know, the starving. Those are s starving artists. Don't be so biased. Artists, I mean... I could be a journalism major. I'm really good at school. Oh. Whatever. Hey, Coop. <laughs> oh. Hey. Um. Hey, Coop. Mm -hmm. Oh, what are you doing wearing that? That's my mom's. Yeah. I thought it was cool. You know, what are you, yeah, what are you doing wearing that? Oh, I thought it was cool. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome. Mm. Good night, dears. I'm going to bed. Mm. Wait, hey, Coop, what's wrong with your mom? She has, she's an has drinking issues sometimes. She just turns into somebody else or something. <sighs> what? I thought she was, like, always sober. I, I mean, I know we all have our dark secrets. <laughs> um, just give her a break. You know, she does work all the time, and it is important to her. When can she ever give herself a break? <laughs> yeah, I, I guess. I don't know. You know? Yeah, maybe when will you give yourself a break, too? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Come on, darling. You're kind of uptight. <laughs> Just chill, relax a little. <laughs> La da 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 Yes. Yeah, father. Uh, who's that? I'm Ivy. I'm supposed to give you a ride to school today because, you know, your mother's, like, asleep or hungover. You're not supposed to tell that in front of my friend's dad. It's okay. I already know. She She's already told me. <laughs> um, about your mom or <laughs> Sometimes, because you're a problem. I don't know. Your mom likes to party. <laughs> yeah. Well. Hmm. Dun, 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 dun. 
Yeah, well, come on, Coop. Let's just let your dad give us a ride. Well, who's your friend? That's Ivy. You haven't met her yet? I'm sure his mom there didn't even tell you. No, I haven't met her. <laughs> nice to meet you. Whatever. I'm a pleasure. Okay, let's get a ride. <laughs> I'm trying to drive. And if you're not listening to our station and our radio, then uh, you're going to have to turn it down. <laughs> oh, uh, wait, pull over, okay? I, why? I'm getting car sick, but me and uh, Coop will do the rest of the walking, okay? Just, Dad, let us out. Okay, okay. You sure? Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna walk. Don't worry. We won't be late. I always take this route. We won't be late. Okay. Get out then. Hey, wait right here, okay? Okay. Sure. Why? Oh, you'll see. Don't worry about it. I've got to go pee over here, okay? Okay. I can't hold it. That's better. <laughs> okay, let's go to school. Wait, Ivy. What are you wearing? Oh, it's... Something your mother gave me. My mom wouldn't even... She wanted me to wear that, and I wouldn't, but later on she got attached to it, and she would have never gave that to me. No, oh, do you want to wear it? <laughs> I can't fit in it. I No, that's not me at all. Well, then what are you complaining about? Let's go to school. <laughs> okay. Hey, Cube, let's just skip school today. Yeah, I'm freaking kind of depressed. I'm just down. Well, let's skip school today. Let's do something and hang out. Do you mean? No, I can't. I can't do that. I want to. Why, scaredy cat? You're like teacher's pet or something. No, it's not that I'm really a serious artist. Yeah, but you have a few other classes you could skip. Let's just go. No, let's come on. Let's get a tattoo. <laughs> no, I, I don't think I want to be getting game green or uh, die of tetanus or whatever. You're not going to. <laughs> or... It seems kind of poisonous and unhealthy. What if I'm allergic to the tattoo ink? Come on, what's more important? Death or friendship? Come on, Coop. Let's go. Come and take a walk on the wild side. With your best friend. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I'll get a peace sign on my ankle or something. Oh, alright. That looks cute. That looks very uh, romantic and beautiful on you. Let's go. Peaceful. <laughs> Hippie of you. <laughs> kind of grunge. <laughs> That's cool too. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> yeah, a peace sign. World peace and everything. Prince of peace. I mean, I think it's cool. There, let's do it. <laughs> I'm living up getting ivy on my leg. You know, like, dreadful, but hopeful, you know, with the cross. <laughs> living and death. It's all tragic. A tragic fairy tale. Oh, by the way, do you have a few bucks? I mean, you know, 
Yeah, that's okay. I got it. Okay, okay. Oh, what are you doing in this store? This is for your hair. I I'm thinking about getting a Brazilian blowout. Well, that's cool. That's going to get rid of all your perm curl, your curls and your perm. Well, I kind of want to use the same hair product as your mother. She's really pretty, you know? Thanks. <laughs> you know, you kind of look more like your father. No offense. Oh, yeah. <sighs> That's not my real mom. <laughs> Sheesh. Well, it's not? No. My real mom's black. <laughs> They I was adopted. They just felt sorry for me. Oh, is that why they act like they want to adopt the whole rest of the world too and do things for them and set them up with a cool career? <laughs> yeah, a dream career that they wish that they had, but they don't. They're just hiring other people. Yeah, <laughs> obviously. <laughs> yeah, I know that's how that's like with people. <laughs> so, okay, cute. Coop, you know, they got the uh, hair stuff ready, and the product, to straighten my hair. Um, you know, they're really waiting on their 70 bucks. What? Whoa. I mean, what do you mean? You said you had the money. I, I'm not just, I mean, well, it's your mom's mother. I mean, your stepmom. Don't call her that. She'll get mad. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. I mean, you know, what's the deal? Uh, hurry. Um, well, you know, my mother said that, I mean, yeah, well, my mom, I call her my mom, mother, because, you know, she's taking care of me. Oh, yeah. Um, that she, you know, that, uh, you know, she said, um, artists are like starving artists, so I don't know. I'm getting allowance. I mean, my, okay, here. My chemicals in my hair. Okay. Whatever. Um, man, I'll pay you back. Or if I could, I'll just go s suck some lollipop guys and give be paid for it or something somewhere. Here, Ivy, just take it. Get your hair done. So if that's so important to you. Thanks, doll. <sighs> Whoa, Barbie Century. What did you why did you take out you don't like it? I mean, it's kind of dull and lifeless looking, but mm, I, I mean at least it's okay. <laughs> Um, no. What did you do to your nose? Oh, I took the nose piercing out. Um, I didn't, I don't know. It kind of, was getting, it was turning green. Because <laughs> it was a fake piercing. <laughs> oh, okay. I thought you were just losing your edge and your cool. <laughs> no. And what edge? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> whatever. We're going to be late for class. <laughs> We're always late. <laughs> Ruth. Yes, yeah, Su what's up, Susan? Uh, well, don't say what's up to me like I'm one of your students. Clean this mess up. We need to find the artifact. You know, the original Ouija board that was in... Angela's loft. It's in there somewhere. We can find it. We'll find it. It's it's in that house somewhere. I'm not going in it. Um. Eh, what do you mean? It's just kind of creepy, and a lot of people try to like say that it's haunted, and I don't believe in that shit. But 
you know, what do you mean you don't believe in it? I mean, this is this is one of the part of the spiritual cult academies there is. Yeah, well, whatever. Just get the artifact that matches that one and the original one. I mean, it really don't matter. I mean, we can sell this just as the original one and make all the profit. No, I don't think it should be dishonest museum work, you know? I mean, I think the artifact should be real because it's legit, you know, for the psychics and stuff. What's psychics? Oh, there's psychics here now, too? Okay, whatever I, I don't know, whatever I missed. Just take care of it, because we really need to pay for that manor down in Utah or something like I mean we really need to get another place to escape to I mean I have more than enough people wanting to do the modeling agency and none of them look like they're gonna be fit for the top because uh, I mean I haven't met one yet since I mean, where's the magazines? Are you handing them out? I mean, you need to start um, producing more kits for that modeling top agency thing and this commercial. I mean, I'll just hand it to the next person who walks in if I have to. Get on with it, Bruce. Clean it up. I wonder if this Ouija board was even real. Hey, what's up? Well, I'm just gonna put this in the closet. Shut the door. The door always falls off. You call a mechanic. Dang it. This is Sydney. Susan. Susan. Oh, it's okay, dear. I just fell down. It's okay. Oh. Oh. Susan. Oh. It's okay, dear. I just fell down. Oh. You think about it, don't you? What? Death. Well, if I was as young and as pretty as you when I used to be, I mean, I, I, you were, you're still pretty. I would be not thinking about that. But that's all in my past. That's all you're gonna get, like, like, looking forward to next. You know, that's all there is, is death. It's, you know, it's gonna become all of us, so. And it's the end, you just don't exist anymore. You, you don't really think that. The, there is an afterlife for you. And even me. And everyone. Hmm. I mean, why would God make all these people 
just so their story would end. I don't know, but it seems pretty much messed up. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, why would he leave me like this? Feeling this kind of crisis. Mm -hmm. I guess you're right. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's, let's go back inside. Uh, na, 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 na. Uh, 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 oh, oh, it looks like you fell again. Uh, 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 let me have, I mean, Mother, mother. Mom? Mom, where are you? Hmm. I got a call from Miss Fear. Mm -hmm. Guess you're not here. What's that? I don't know. There's all kinds of species around here in this world. And the paranoid crazy. Yeah. What would you do if, you know, yeah, you, you died? I don't know. What I know what I want to live is I own a family and a sports car. It's what my dreams used to be till I met you and, you know, have a family. I never had a family like you. Mm -hmm. That necklace is beautiful. Yeah, my father gave it to me. I've never had anybody give me anything so beautiful. <laughs> well, it's kind of cheap, but it's so beautiful. <laughs> That's a beautiful necklace. Thanks, my father gave it to me. Wow. I've never owned anything that beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Aren't we going to be late for class? We're always late for class. <laughs> Let's go do something else today. What are we going to do this time while I'm in fear? <laughs> Mm. Well, after your art class, we can skip the other three classes. Um, <sighs> what? You'll see. Surprise. Okay. Sure. Mm -hmm. Um, okay. Well, I gotta go. The My art class is right now. It's happening now. I can't skip it. <laughs> well, what are you gonna do? I don't know. I already skipped classes. I guess I'll just find my own way around doing something around here. I'll probably just go swing on that rope swing. Okay. You don't be late. No, okay. I'll try the rope swing with you. I mean, yeah, you're gonna have to do before you. 
I don't know that witch was... Who cares about a rope swing anyways? Yeah. <sighs> I guess. Are you scared to go on it? Is that why you don't want to go on it? No, I'm not scared. I can do anything. I put my mind's eye to it. <laughs> um, here, you go first. I gotta go back to class. Oh well, who cares about a rope swing anyway? Those roll rope swing. Mm. Well, I gotta get to class. Who cares about an old witch's rope swing anyways? You have friends. <laughs> and she'll, she'll go to her art class. And... Oh, Bruce, hey, what are you, Ivy, what are you doing here? Oh, I was looking for the loft, the artist loft. I don't know where um, Coop is at, Darlene went. No, oh, that's okay. Well, I guess I I need a letter um, that I'm late for class or something. I don't know. I'll just that, that's okay. I'll write you a letter. You could. Uh, yeah. Guess I'll just spend some time with you. Um, Swing about that witch, my witch. No, I'm just so happy to uh, try to find this Ouija board at, at this um, really scary place that no one really seems to go to. They end up missing or something. What? <laughs> okay. But, mm, I guess I'm not gonna go to that either. <laughs> Um, Bruce. Have you seen my, um, Garden Eden account? You know, n no, why? Well, um, I'm really busy. I gotta get to work to work. Wait, I told you I haven't seen it. Well, we are both up for this promotion and, you know, what are you trying to accuse me of? I mean, you think I really need to steal your script and garden in an account just to get win this promotion? N no, I don't know. I guess not. Okay. What are you doing here then? 
<laughs> okay. So, you're going to be Jack, right? Well, yeah. I mean, I could play Jack, but I'm not really uh, into guys. But I can play the part. Yeah, that's the point. You're just supposed to play a part. You don't have to be in real life, you're like, you know, hetero or homo or whatever. You can be straight and play a gay part. I mean, just Jack. Yeah, that's the point, you know. Just. All right. Well, can I be Linda's girlfriend? You mean Grace's girlfriend? <laughs> well, that's okay. You could you could be Linda's boyfriend um, eventually, so you don't have to be Jack. That's fine. Yeah, you did do good at that. Okay, Lynn. Karen. Check. Will. Yeah. I'm going to be playing the character Will. <laughs> I Sounds good. Let me type this up. <laughs> Before I went dark. Uh, Elaine. Hey. Um, hello. Hi. I'm Elaine. Yeah, I, I thought you were Elaine. How did you guess? Well, it's just a good guess, I guess. Um, are you ready? Because, um, I got a, your ride, you know, in my van. You can come see your place now. Oh, okay. Let me just finish up here and sign out. Okay, I guess I'm ready. <laughs> Wow, looks kind of creepy. Yeah, it's like that on the outside. On the inside, it's even creepier. <laughs> Great. What do you think? Is this the only closet? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Oh. Oh my god. The door fell off. Yeah, the mechanics haven't fixed, the maintenance haven't fixed it yet. And what is, what's this? Oh, that's a Ouija board. Looks like a Ouija board. Oh, wow. Okay. Nifty. Must be the last person who lived here. Okay. Well. And upstairs is the loft where you'll be sleeping. If... Okay. I'll take it. Mm-hmm. Okay, great. Mm -hmm. You just sign the lease tomorrow morning and you'll be great. You can stay here tonight if you want. Whatever. No pressure. Um, well, I have to go back to, you know, art is calling me. Mm hmm. And they'll be calling you soon, too. You want to be an artist, right? Yeah, that's why I'm here to see. And find out. <laughs> Great. Mm -hmm. We'll see you in class. Okay. See ya. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, Paige? Yeah? There's somebody here to see you. What? No one knows where I'm moving here. No one should know. Well, um, I think you should check it out. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
page. <gasps> Mitch, what are you doing here? I, I, you know, how did you find out where I'm, where I'm at? Well, public records. Um, yeah, I haven't even signed the lease yet. <sighs> well, in getting an interview for the place uh, does the trick. Same thing. Shows out where people are located. That's my job. It's part of the job. So, um, why are you here? I, you wouldn't understand. I'm trying to be an artist. Well, you could have just set your stuff up in the garage at home. No, you don't understand. Well, damn it, what am I supposed to understand? Mitch, please, stop yelling at me. It, it's just not working out. What's not working out? Please, stop. Stop what? I, let me just find out myself if I'm going to be an artist. I mean, I can't stand this. You, you, you're just so aggressive. Okay, um, well, maybe I wouldn't be so aggressive if you wouldn't be sneaking around, you know, moving out all of a sudden and... Um, hey, excuse me? Uh, no, excuse me? You might want to find some other business somewhere else, because you're in mine right now. Um, well, this is kind of my business, because... Um, this is part of, um, my territory. I mean, I am, you know, me and my girlfriend are part of the landlords, you know, we are for the homeless shelter next door, but, um, yeah. So is there a problem here with y'all? Or is there a problem? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you in our business. You wouldn't want me to call the police, would you? Um, I am the police. <laughs> so, yeah, sorry. Well, you you know, five three thirty eight. That's your uh, badge number, right? Yeah. Well, I might need to get a hold of your supervisor to show them how good you are with public relations around here. If you know what I mean. You might want to take a hike. Okay, then. Damn, you must, you must have have gotten a bunch of parking tickets that I haven't been paid. Something. No, that's my ex-boyfriend. Oh, <laughs> sorry. Hi. Hi. I'm 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 Ricky. I'm Paige. <laughs> well, if you need any help or uh have any questions or somewhere to hang out, um me and my girlfriend, uh we live next door, you know. Up there in the castle. Okay. That's fine. You know something? What? You got a great face. Oh, no, no, I'm not coming on to you or anything. I mean, I do got a girlfriend. I, I'm a photographer, and I just think that maybe you want to come by and I could take photos of you sometime. I don't know. That's, I can't be, I'm, no, you should. Here's my card. Okay, thanks. <laughs> That's weird. Oh, wait. Russell? And Ricky? Oh. Uh, yeah? Um, I do need your help, actually. Can you pick this door up and put it back on? Oh, yeah, sure. This always happens all the time. Okay. Just set it up right here. Just a few little screws that are loose. There you go. Good as new. 
Thanks. Hey, what is this? Um, oops. I don't, I don't know. I think that's part of that game over there or something. A game? What kind of game? I'll put this back. Um, it's called a witch board or something? Oh. That's creepy. No, it's just like chests or checkers or something. I don't know. Well, I wouldn't play it alone. What do you mean? Uh, because you could be a uh, witch board possessed and it could make you more aggressive and, you know, you could be addicted to it, communicating with this unknown that's connected to those boards. You really believe in this stuff? Well, um, we do live in a place of, uh, full of occult knowledge and there's kind of some stories and um, my girlfriend's kind of had some experience with some paranormal type things and it's, there's no reason to s not to and no, or to turn, doubt it, so well, just be careful. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's strange. Okay, well, let's see if this thing works. Hello? Is there is somebody who's here? <gasps> These things actually work? Who is this? S U A N Susan? Yes. Susan, do you know anything about my promotion? What happened? E D I N Eden? You know about the Eden account? Yes. What happened to it? C R O L Carla? Bitch. <laughs> what are you doing in here? Um, that's for you to get lost and me to find out. <laughs> You need to get out of my office. This is my space. This is my office. This is where I work. Shut the fuck up. If you ever pull a thing like this again, you'll be calculating on the calculator how many teeth that are missing from you. Don't ever pull a stunt like this again. Uh. <laughs> Hello, Mega Beta Zeta. This is Paige Math Bennett. Benedict. Um. <laughs> Hello, this is Paige Benedict. Paige, it's me. I just need to talk to you. <laughs> what this? What's this about again, Mitch? I told you, I just need a break. From you screaming at me and smothering me and not letting me express and be myself. I told you you could be in the garage. <laughs> Whatever. I, I just need a, some time. Uh, God damn it, Paige. Just talk to me now. Uh. <sighs> <laughs> Hey, 
Hey, Russell. Yeah? Oh, hey, Paige. How's your new loft and place going? It's good, but do you know all the tenants that lived here, used to live here and stuff? Who was the last person who lived here? Well, uh, there's the head court people, uh, Susan and Bruce and their daughters. Oh, Susan. What do you really know about her? Well, uh, sh she's the head of this whole corporation. Oh, cool. Hey, meet my girlfriend. This is Julia. Hi, Julia. Th Julia, this is Paige. Hi, Paige. Hi. Well, do you want me to take your photo? I can't. <laughs> no, you are. Just sit there. Okay. Be sexy. I can't be sexy. I just can't. I just don't know how to be. You can. Come on. Whatever. Just relax. <sighs> you know, you could be a model. You could sign up for the modeling campaign place. What? I don't know. <laughs> I just don't know how to do stuff like this. <laughs> I've, what do you mean? I've never let myself go or anything. I've just always been well kept and uptight about everything. And no, I'm just trying to do new things, I guess. That's what's changed your mind. I don't know, I was just kind of inspired by art. Hey, I can ask you a question. Yeah, what? Do you know anything about Ouija boards? Ouija boards? Yeah. Um, they can contact the ghost. I, I believe they're real. Why? Oh, well, I found one in my apartment and I was just wondering. Um, it just might sound silly. No, it's okay. Would you play with me? Okay. Just I just want to know if it's real. I mean, I just I've done it by myself, and it's kind of real. I think you. Yeah, y'all shouldn't be doing it alone. I'll go with you. Okay. Well, let's go. Oh my gosh. I can't believe you just brought that to my work. Oh, hey Paige, I was just bringing this to your work like you said uh, to bring it to you. Oh, I didn't know. I thought, you, I just, well, I didn't know you wanted me to, where do you put to give it to you? I didn't have the directions. Oh, well, I thought you knew all about this place. I, I wanted you to bring it to um, Ricky's and um, Julia's. Loft. Okay. Well, here it is. Here's the Ouija board, you guys. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Be careful with those things. What do you mean, Linda? Um. Well. Whoa. You don't want to mess with those. Why? What do you know about Ouija boards? That's the devil's doorway. The Devil's Doorway? I mean, well then why does it say other names than the Devil? It can trick you. Um, well what if it really is contacting other spirits other than the Devil? I mean, what harm is in that? Mm, well, physical things could happen, like things flying around the walls and stuff. Really? <laughs> well, I asked this before um, about where my uh, Eden account was, the, our script, you know, for our show. Um, and it told me Carla stole it. And then when I went to her office, I found it. That bitch tried to steal my promotion by cheating. Really? Wow. 
Well, who is this? Hello? No, don't. You'll get addicted. <laughs> well, it's here to tell us answers, and it's pretty much a good spirit. So I guess it's on my side. And her name's... Well, who is it? Who's talking to you, if it's not the devil? Her name's Susan. What? Yeah, her name's Susan. I can't believe you're trying to contact my mother through this Ouija board. Uh, I didn't know. What do you mean, your mother? Oh my god. This is hers. <sighs> Whatever, my father's been looking for that. But it's not the right one. <sighs> She's looking for the one of the other manor. Locked. What? Ooh. What? Darlene, I didn't mean to. I mean, it was just in my loft, and it started moving. <laughs> my mother isn't dead. She's just... Well, I haven't seen her lately. Last time she was drinking. But... What? I don't know. Like I said, it could trick you. It could... It's, it's the doorway to the devil. It, they could say it's one person, but be another, you know? It, what do you mean, all spirits are liars? Well, I'm sure it's not Satan himself. I mean, you're playing one Ouija board. <laughs> well, <laughs> I don't know. It, it just... Stay away from it. Well, what if it needs help? <sighs> who... Finding out who this is, real this, who this really is. You're just playing tricks on me. No one's playing tricks on you. Not even knew you were even here. I don't even know who your mother is. That's true. I just moved in. Well, this still belongs to me, and I want to find out more. So I might take it to somebody. Do you know anybody? Um. There is, there's witchcraft stores and psychic stores here. Maybe you could take it to them. That's a good idea. Okay, let's go do that. <laughs> oh, that was so pretty cute. What does it say on its papers? It's a strawly sign. Well, it's, her name's Jelly, and... Her birthday is July 16th. What year? 2019. Oh my. This means that she's a Cancer. Scorpio Rising Moon and Capricorn. Okay. $800. Here's your money. Alright. Thank you. Oh. I'm glad she's going to a good new owner, new home. Thank you. All right. Bye. Toodles. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, hi. Mm -hmm. Hey. Oh, um, you work here? Um, I was wondering what you could tell me about this Ouija board and, you know, who's possessing it and if it's good or evil or whatever. Do you... No, I don't work here, but I am a psychic medium, but I don't work here, and I don't need a Ouija board to talk to spirits, communicate with spirits, I am just go by experience and stuff. Oh, but it actually really works. Right, prove it, yeah, right. No, see? I'll prove it, yeah. Susan? Susan, are you here? Mmm, nice. That's cool and all. I, I, I just think it's pretty decorations. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey. Hey. Um, what's your astrology sign? Oh, I, I think I'm a Capricorn or something. Well, when's your birthday? Uh, January 22nd. Oh, you're actually Capricorn Cusp Aquarius. Oh, yeah? 
Are you a Scorpio? What? I don't believe it. I don't, I don't believe in that stuff. What? Well, you don't believe in Ouija boards, so what's the difference? Um. Well, I didn't say I didn't believe in it. I just don't. I don't think it works. I mean, it's just not. Spirits don't do anything physical. I've never seen them do anything physical. Uh, okay, and well, he's a psychic. What's your name? My name is Dashton. Um, well, maybe you could read me or something. And actually, how do you know I was a Scorpio? I was born November 3rd. <laughs> oh, you are a Scorpio. I could just tell. Doesn't mean I'm, that doesn't mean I'm psychic. I mean, astrology is not psychic. It's just different. It's like a social opportunity kind of thing. Whatever. I just call my dog. I don't have my camera. And if I was to give you a psychic reading, I would have to film it. Okay, well, I do have a studio when there is cameras there. Oh god, my dog's getting away from me. Uh, 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 uh. I gotta go get my dog. I gotta go get my dog. It's running away. Uh. Come here. Come here, Peggy. Peggy. I just named it Peggy and it won't come. It doesn't listen. Yeah. Okay, well, I guess nobody's working here. It seems empty. <sighs> No, it stopped working. Will you help me get it to work? Maybe I need another person. Okay, I got my dog. No, if you want to get that to work, maybe you have to go to a haunted place or something, and maybe it'll work. I don't know. But I would have to cycle get in tune with you. And Oh, my dog's getting away. Maybe he's right. Okay, let's just take it back to the apartment loft. Oh, good idea. Mm -hmm. Carla? Y yeah, Susan? You're fired for stealing papers and scripts from one of my clients. Get out of here. You get out of this office now. What? She's lying. I would never steal for that promotion. Get out. We have proof. And we have cameras. So, just get out. You're pathetic. <laughs> Whatever you washed out has been. Susan? Are you here? Mm -hmm. I swear this worked before. Mm -hmm. Maybe you should put your hands on it. Okay, okay. I mean, this is silent and dangerous. Are you here? <gasps> oh my gosh, this thing does work. I told you, I told you, it really is is real. Someone is named Susan is dead here, and she probably needs our help. Do you need a Susan? Do you need our help? How how did you die? I am N O T D E A D. I'm not dead. What? Susan, are you lying to me? I'm going to turn you out, throw this away in the trash if you're a demon, and this is not Susan. Susan isn't dead, then. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
Paige, Paige, what's wrong? Oh my gosh, Paige. <sighs> Susan, wake up, Paige, right now. She must be dizzy from something. <sighs> Paige, where are you going? <gasps> Paige? <laughs> who, who are you? Where did you come from? It's me, Susan. <laughs> oh my God, you're taking out your possessed Paige's body. Get out of her body. <laughs> well, it's okay. You can just let me go. No. I mean, this is a nice body, but mine's better. I mean, I was a dancer. <laughs> Paige, are you in there? I knew it was possession. <laughs> I want my life back. I thought you wasn't dead. I'm not. <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> Uh, if you're not gonna let me go, then you're not leaving. You get in this Ouija board. Ah, uh, 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 Linda. Uh, 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 no, I'm supposed to be playing in the new show Will and Grace, and I am Grace. <laughs> you may have had your prime. I'm having. I'm gonna be in mine. Uh, uh, no, you're not going anywhere. Uh, mm -hmm. Mother? <laughs> oh, I, I'm sorry. I, I thought you were my mother. That's really weird. Mm, Darlene? <gasps> How did you know my name? No one calls me that, that name but my mother. I hate that name. Don't ever do it again. Mm, oh, sorry. I, I don't know what just happened. Um, where is your mother? I don't know. Wait. Play the Ouija board with me, please. Just let me know I'm not crazy. Linda, are you okay? You hit me. You were possessed, Paige. What are y'all talking about? Play... The Ouija board. No, don't play the Ouija board. You'll be possessed again. Susan? Paige, stop it. Susan, where are you? Mm, that's not my mother. Mm, quit playing the game. C O M A Coma? That's not my mom. Stop it. Stop lying to me, yourselves. For attention, what is wrong with you? A coma. You, Susan, you're in a coma? Where at? R O O F. Roof? The roof? She's not on the roof. I, I just checked last time she was there when Briar called. <gasps> it's still moving. I the why? Ivy? Ivy? Oh. <laughs> Father, 
behind me? <sighs> Coop. Uh, uh, we can all be a family now. <sighs> oh my god. Mother. <laughs> Dad, Mom is on the ground over there. You killed her. She wanted to die. Uh, ah, uh, we can all be a family. We can all be together. No. Uh, uh, Mother, she's still alive. Quick, call the ambulance. Susan, I'm sorry. You cheated. She seduced me, and I thought he, with that dress on, I kind of thought it was her. Mm, whatever. <laughs> what Ivy wants, Ivy gets. So beautiful. What Ivy wants, Ivy gets. So beautiful. Poison Ivy. Page. Yes, Officer Mitchell. <laughs> Can I call you when you get settled into your new uh, apartment? I'd be offended if you didn't. <laughs> Mm. I guess I'm not your ex after all. No, we'll never break up. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 